If you're looking to get insane players, then go take a spin on primefoot.com. You can get players like Ronaldo, Messi, Pele, Hullet, or Beckenbauer, and use my discount code GOON, it will get you 10, yes, 10% 10 off. What's up guys, Guinness to here, bringing you another Team of the Year player review, and today we are reviewing Team of the Year Tony Kroos. I decided to play him as a cam, and there's the team that I played him in. Remember guys, 200 likes would be amazing. Make sure you follow me on Twitter as well. So, so happy to pick up this card. Nice to see a different midfielder in there as well. And taking a look at him, six foot, medium, medium work rates, right footed, five star weak foot, three star skill moves. Cost me just under 1.3 million. Played 10 games, got me six goals and three assists as well, which isn't a bad return. So how does he compare to his regular card? Well, it's massive increases right there. He's gone up by eight overall. You can see that passing has gone up by eight. Dribbling by 7, physical by 9, shooting, defending and pace have all gone up by 10. And you can see that in the in-game stats, this guy is outstanding. Look at that strength for 83 as well, that is decent. And you can see vision 95, so many dark green stats right there. You know, just outstanding in terms of what he can do, even when you look at the balance of how he's skilled as well. And you can see shot power, oh, absolutely amazing. His shooting, his finishing is 85. Just all round long shots, absolutely outstanding. There's so many things in the 90s and in the dark green. Just raving about this guy. He can play anywhere across midfield in terms of the central positions. Does a fantastic job. Weighs 172 pounds, so he's not lightweight either. And what you'll see is how stacked he is. Long shot taker, dribbler, playmaker, distance shooter, crosser, freak kick specialist, complete midfielder. So what are my expectations of this card? Well, as soon as I saw that he got a team of the year, I thought absolutely outstanding. This guy is going to be unbelievable and he doesn't disappoint. The only thing that you can say bad about him is he's not the quickest. He is slow for a team of the year card. 68 pace is not that slow for a midfielder normally. However, when you're thinking it's a team of the year, he is slow for that. But put that to one side and this card is absolutely outstanding, world class. If it wasn't for that lack of pace, it'd be the perfect card in the game in terms of midfield because absolutely outstanding. I played him at Cam. He can do anything for you. His shooting is absolutely unbelievable. It's almost like cheating how good his shooting is. Long shots, anywhere from like 30 yards, he will have a chance of beating the keeper. It's just absolutely amazing. Remember, he's got a five-star weak foot as well, which is quality. This guy can pass for days, fantastic passing. You know, he can do pretty much everything that you want your midfielder to do. Vision, awareness, balance, fantastic dribbling as well. He's there for your free kicks, you know, your set pieces, everything he will deliver for you in terms of what you want a midfielder to do. I can't rave highly enough about this guy. All you have to do is pick it up and you'll find out. I mean, is he worth the coins? Definitely. He's even worth the 1.3 million I paid for him. That's how good this guy is. So let's review overall what I thought about him. He's got flawless shooting. His long shots are absolutely amazing. Some of the best in the game. His passing's amazing. Fantastic range of passing. It's fantastic to dribble with as well. Free kicks, he'll just take them for days and beat the keeper. Strong as well. And he's also got the five-star weak foot. So all key things just make him a fantastic player in the game. The only thing I can say bad about him is that he lacks pace. And I know that's a big deal to a lot of you guys. But overall, I don't care. I think he's a fantastic player. For me, worth every single coin that I paid for him. And I'm going to give him a 9.75 out of 10. If he only had a little bit more pace, he would have got the 10 out of 10. So that's the review, guys. Go pick him up if you can afford him. Highly recommend him. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like below, comment, subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.